Hello guys, in this video I will be talking about the new eye design which I recently developed in the last two days. So just before showing you I will like to run the program. So as you can see the pattern is similar to the last time for the outer side but for the inside that is for the eyeball it's a bit different. As you can see there are sine curves as well as some vertical curve which originates from the center of the eye and come back to the center. So there are also some yellow curves just to give a contrast as this design in different colors will be plotted on a white paper for my projects so when you see this with the colors it will be like more vibrant and it will more look like a, an eye so as you can see in the perspective it looks really cool but on paper with different colors it really looks good so I tried to make this design via algorithms which I'm going to explain you right now. So let me open my Python. Okay. So as always I've imported some of the class as you can see the random rhino script syntax math and then I have created the three different colors like the black blue and yellow and after that as you can see here I define count step zero these are for just the loops so that it ends at a uh, end point and this is for the this is for the root 2 yeah and this is pi value as you can see for making this pattern the one which I have selected right now I have written this code so as you can see this is a sine cos function and a sine sine function in the Cartesian coordinates so what this program does is it goes from 0 to 25 pi that is the maximum value of pi in the intervals of pi by 8 and it creates different points and these points are appended together and what do you mean by append is that the points are clubbed together and these points are then used to make a single curve so by this command I can make a curve using these points so once these points are traced back into a curve it will look something like this and then I have defined the color for that curve and that is object color 1 which is blue so hence this curve is in blue color and for making vertical and angular lines the program is something similar to the last video which I made for the eye design so I guess it will be easier for you to understand and this is the number of lines zero to 41 so that many times you can make the lines and 
the next part is for making the blue line which is here so as you can see these lines start at the center and they come back to the center and it's blue in color so this happens like for roughly 300 times and then it stops so as you can see I have a command for making that line and this is a condition that the distance of the point should not be greater than 26 and should not be less than 27 so I always restrict them inside a circle of 27 and 26 so these curves they should have a distance of 26 or 27 minimum from the center and then I have colored the eyes depending on the condition like if count is greater than 220 I will give this color so like after words if there are 80 more numbers they will be colored in this color and if it is less than 220 it will give color 1 while the same logic is used to make the black lines which you can see inside so these black lines they give a good contrast when you plot it on a uh, actual plotter using color pens and it gives a good contrast with these colors and it actually looks like an eyeball which is made using just curves and equations so here the same condition is used but this time the distance is reduced to 10 and 11 that is because the black ball should be smaller in size and it is by default black color so there is no condition like here for the change in color so here as you can see what happens in this part is 220 curves are made in blue and the rest of the 80 curves are made in yellow color so it is that simple how you can program to make such patterns which are really interesting 